we're using the waterless leak detection kit here and uh, pretty much just take all the jet fittings out, motor massage, uh, all that. You find all the right size plugs for these, crank them down to where they're tight, uh, you know, to where they're not going to pop out on you. Um, there's these little rubber cone plugs that we use for the drains and the airlines right there. Um, then pretty much just hooked all this up with the uh, air compressor here and use the gauge and ran it between 5 and 10 psi and we know it's right around 5 psi it makes a pretty good sound you can hear leaks pretty good um, all together doing all this taking all the jets out putting all this in uh, on a tub like this takes about two hours our first time we did it so uh, not too bad but it did. so we did start with this completely intact uh, board was in place all this foam is still foam was on the outside and with using it after plugging it up putting the air in it and listening to where it was making a hissing or growling noise out of, we were able to pinpoint through the foam and find these, and that's when we excavated all the foam to find these leaks. Uh, took about 10 minutes. After the plugs were in place and the air was applied, listening to it, you could hear it through this, and just listening to where it got louder, and just start chipping away, and found both of them. Uh, one of them was right here at this T, that one was a little higher pitched of a hiss, smaller crack. The other one was this piece of one and a half was cracked at a manifold right here to these two three quarter inch lines. And that one was more of a gurgling, boiling kind of sound and, than a hiss, but it did find it. Um, you can hear it through the foam. Without the Butters uh, wireless in foam leak detection kit, um, this would have taken close to a day to find these leaks was filling it up with water and waiting for it to leak through and then tipping it up on the side and excavating all the foam.